gang it's your girl red slave back hold up y'all see them teeth man if you don't got pearly whites what are you doing but anyways it's your girl red slave back what a video and today what i'm gonna be doing i'm actually not doing the reaction video but i'm gonna be doing a story time if you're new to the channel and you didn't see my other story time about this same person then you're probably going to be a little lost but go watch that go check it out it was my worst date date ever go check that out this is the same exact person i'm going to be talking about and this happened the same day after it was time for me to go after he fed me that bad ass food so we gonna go ahead oh before i do that make sure you subscribe to the channel if you new hit that red button down there it's not that hard i know your finger's not broke if you're looking at this video comment down below what you think and guess what like this video get this video to a thousand likes a thousand likes i want this video to and let's get straight into this video okay so as I was telling y'all before about, I'm going to give the name Billy again, about Billy. If you watch my other video, you can see, like I said, he wanted to, oh, give me a kiss and all of that afterwards. I wasn't with it. I was already ready to go. I was not with it. So he goes to tell me, he like, well, you're not leaving. Well, who not leaving? Last time I checked, I am grown. So who not leaving? Me or you? Because if anything, I'm going to get you out my way. Whether you like it or not. So he like, oh, you not moving. This and that. I said, well, I'm leaving. I'm going to leave this house tonight, whether you like it or not. So he like, oh, let's go in my room. Let's watch another movie. We just got done watching this sorry old behind karate kid and i was bored out of my brain like just bored like kill me already get me out of here so i guess i'm gonna re um, remind y'all he a hood dude first of all my first time ever talking to somebody so hood because not to i don't have nothing against hood dudes but i really like be for basketball players and football players and like soccer players <laughs> but y'all get where i'm going with that right i don't really date hood dudes so this was all new for me he was so demanding so controlling i'm like listen i barely even know you you not my daddy your name is not mj let me stop so i'm just confused at this point because i'm like um no who you run not not me so after i didn't want to go in his room he feel like he just want to tell me this story <laughs> so he started this story off right first of all i don't want to know about another female why are you telling me about another female for that ain't got no nothing to do with me that ain't none of my business so that's red flag number one why are you even telling me about somebody else i don't care so i thought i think he thought this story was gonna scare me like it ain't gonna scare me First of all, and if you try to do the same thing you did to that girl, it wasn't going to happen with me. And if he see that, I hope you see this too. So you can know, stop playing with a real one. I am a real nigga, bro. So he like, oh, he used to date this girl. I'm going to name her Samantha. He used to date this girl named Samantha. I guess she came over to Eve and they was chilling and everything. So... He was giving Samantha a massage. He told Samantha, oh, take off all your clothes. Let me give you a full body massage. Blah, blah, blah. You're like, you gonna like it. So he, he's telling me the story. He's giving Samantha a massage. Yeah, going to work. She's liking it, loving it, laying there in his bed, just chilling. So he said he went to touch it, Samantha and this and that. And Samantha wasn't with it, like. She's like, no, that's not why I came. Um, <clears throat> okay, so she's like, no, that's not what I came for. 
I came just to chill with you, have a good time, you know? How most females be, but you know, dudes always got to ruin that. I don't know why. Is it good dudes out there in the world? But yeah. So he like, oh, he started touching on her and she wasn't feeling it. She didn't like it. So then he like, it made him mad because she didn't want to have sex with him. So what he did, right? Kicked this girl out of his house. But as naked, no freaking clothes on. Like, really? Really, bro? No clothes on. This girl had no clothes on. He kicked her out of the house with no clothes on. Because she didn't want to have sex with him. Like, is it her body or is it your damn body, boy? Is it that hard to find a little, you feel me? I mean, y'all. <laughs> but is it that hard honestly so he like oh he dropped all right so after that he kicked her out the house she locked out she's knocking on his door she trying to get in she just want to get her clothes and leave at this point so as he getting deeper into the to into the story i'm thinking like in my head like is he saying i'm gonna be locked out naked or something like let me know please so, but I'm still, you know, chilling because one thing about me, I'm not like other people. I'm going, tch, you think you're going to try me, it's not going to happen. I'm not like other people. I'm a different, I'm, I am a different kind, bro. I promise y'all. So, he like, oh, when it was time for her to come home, to I mean, to go home, he got her clothes out of the house. She thinking she getting a ride home because he the one dropped her off there. He the one picked her up. I'm going to say that. You picked her up. Your ass gonna drop me back off home. That's all I gotta say. If nobody never gonna try me like that. Samantha, whoever you is, man. I ain't gonna say a real name out here, but I don't know you, but I seen a picture of you. Man up. Don't let these dudes do you like that. I promise you. Don't let them do you like that. Tell them who in charge. And that's on game. And that's on slay gang at that. Oh my game, bro. <laughs> Yeah, so he fucking um got her clothes. They getting in the car. She's naked. Remind you, he still didn't let her back in the house to put the clothes on or nothing. Tell me why this man left this girl in the middle of the road to walk home, butt ass naked. And he telling me, oh, you don't want to do nothing with me. I'm going to do you just like Samantha. You're going to be going home with no clothes. And this side said, you got me fucked up. <coughs> Excuse my French, but he had me messed up who walking home who going home naked just like when you picked me up and i was fully dressed i'm going home fully dressed and i'm not walking home because you picked me up one thing oh one thing about it bro i spoke my mind to that man because he had me messed up you're not gonna do me how you did another female ain't none of that Look at, look at my face. Ain't none of that. I was, I don't even like walking, dog. I promise y'all. I first got my car at what? My first car I ever got at seven. So I was 16 turning 17. Ever since then, I never liked it walking again. So you really think I'm about to walk home? You're crazy as hell. And butt ass naked as that, you're crazy. Y'all think I was going to let him get these clothes off me? He was going to have to fight me if anything because I don't play that. But listen, more of the story is what I'm telling y'all learn from this. Watch who you talk to. Because they can seem like they just the nicest person, this and that. Watch who you talk to. Or else a dude would be trying to kick y'all out of his house making y'all be butt ass naked and shit y'all better tell her hey you don't want to go you gonna score up they don't play on me <laughs> tell her, Ooh. he would have had me messed up if i would have walked home but i ain't gonna lie the whole time we was in the car bro and he taking me home he's like yeah i should have did you how i did samantha and this and i'm like bro you can cut that act right there because it wasn't gonna happen so we got to the front of my neighborhood right he was like you can get out and walk from here nigga who just like you pick me up from back there you gonna drop me off right back there in front of my house 
not in front of my neighborhood who the hell walking back at night back home from the front of my neighborhood no you drop you pick me up from the front of my door drop me off back where you picked me up from and i hope he see this you feel me because boy 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 let me stop <laughs> but i hope y'all like this story time it was just something to you know something for y'all to see to enjoy laugh i know y'all get tired of me doing these reaction videos or maybe y'all don't so that was just something i wanted to show y'all i hope you like it don't forget to like this video let's get this to 200 likes comment down below what you think about this story time and subscribe to my channel especially if you're new subscribe we lit i'm on my way to 2k and i'm out